Hey, this is Heath Mulliken with The Techology Show, and this video is brought to you by Wesley Seminary at Indiana Wesleyan University. I am here with Lenny Lucchetti, who teaches at Wesley Seminary. One of the things he teaches is uh, being a better preacher, and his book is Preaching Essentials. You can pick it up at WPHonline.com. Uh, Lenny, I wanted to ask you about this, but what is unique about this book that a young pastor, preacher like myself, uh, can take from and become a better preacher? Yeah, I, I wrote the book for two reasons, Heath. Uh, one reason was just really uh, my heart to communicate to young preachers that preaching still matters. I think that's, that's a big uh, issue these days because a lot of young preachers who are capable and gifted and called are being told by some church experts that, that preaching doesn't matter, that uh, preaching is a useless way to make disciples. And uh, I wanted to say, I wanted to speak to that and tell uh, young preachers and even seasoned preachers that uh, God still uses preaching to set captives free, to build his kingdom. It's not the only thing he uses, but he certainly uses preaching. And so uh, that was really the sort of the heart behind the book. And then I really just uh, went looking for a book I could use for my class uh, that would frame a lot of the issues in preaching in a contemporary progressive way. And there really hasn't been a book sort of a, a, a fully orbed book like that written uh, in the last 30 years that I could find. There's some good preaching books out there, but not one that framed a lot of the issues in a practical, uh, insightful way. So I wrote, I wrote this book with 42 short chapters, uh, each chapter ending with exercises or reflection questions to sort of help the reader think about uh, their own context and how to, how to apply the principles to their own context. So, um, so that's really the gist of the book. So what would you say as you, I mean, you obviously hear a lot of young preachers, good and bad. What is the one thing you would say to this generation, hey, you can't be a good preacher without? Well, first of all, uh, preaching is a spiritual discipline. I mean, you have to, the preacher has to stay connected with Christ through the homiletic process. And, and unfortunately, uh, rhetoric, which we can learn from, has hijacked Christian preaching away from a spiritual connection between a preacher and Christ. The other thing I would say is uh, uh, p- good preaching is creative and contextual. Uh, I think a lot of preachers feel this burden to have to put the sermon in a three-point mold. Not that God can't use that three-point form, but uh, preachers are pretty much stymied in their creativity a lot of times because they've been taught that there's only one way to do it. And, and my book was written really to say there's a, there's a wide variety of ways to skin the cat uh, to, to preach the sermon. And so I want to I bring out a preacher's creativity. And then, and then to, to put the gospel in a container people can drink from in that context. So, so we, we have a lot of books about sound exegesis and creative homiletics. Uh, very little has been written about uh, uh, carefully analyzing your context and then preaching in a way that connects with the particular group you're preaching to. Now tell us a little bit about Wesley Seminary. It's a few years old now. Have you had several cohorts go through and graduate? Uh, what what is something you love about Wesley Seminary and, the, and what it's providing for for pastors out there? Well, going back to what I said about uh, contextuality, uh, our, our students are in ministry somewhere, so they are learning uh, theology, history, Bible practical ministry, and then immediately applying it to their particular context, uh, which is a very unique approach in seminary education. Uh, we're also, one of the other unique aspects of Wesley Seminary is that we, we have a practical class like preaching and uh, view preaching, the practice of preaching through the lens of Bible, theology, church history. So in a lot of traditional seminaries, you have theology here, history here, Bible here, preaching here. Uh, in Wesley Seminary, you're forced to think biblically, theologically, historically about the practice of preaching. So you put all that together in an integrated approach that, that uh, uh, I think uh, fosters an appreciation in students for not just the practice, but the foundations of history, Bible, theology. You learn to appreciate it all better in the context of a practice. Yeah, yeah. Awesome. Well, once again, it's Lenny Lucchetti. His book is Preaching Essentials. You can get it at WPHonline.com. I want to thank his son, Zach, for being in this interview with us. Now, Lenny, do you have a blog, or how can people find you online, Twitter, and places like that? Uh, Twitter, uh, at Lenny Lucchetti, and um, uh, uh, LennyLucchetti.blogspot.com. Awesome. Hey, thank you so much. 
by the book. Indiana Wesleyan University. The Wesleyan Church is the church that is associated with Indiana Wesleyan University. We brought a team together to think about how we might start a seminary that was something different from what was already out there. So you have this team teaching approach where you're not just looking at practice in one course and Bible in another course, but you're looking at them both in the same course and connected to each other. I think it is important for the pastors to come here and understand a particular method of understanding culture and context so they can relate their principles to the particular community that they are serving. We incorporate your being in ministry into the actual instruction. This is almost completely unique to Wesley Seminary. We thought that we could bring some of the skills that we've learned from training adults to the creation of a seminary, and, and uh, by God's grace, we've done that. Wesley Seminary at Indiana Wesleyan University. Change your life, change the world.